Hey, what's going on guys? Chris Travis here with Fandra.com. Taking a look at Aircast, this uh, previously known as MyCast. This is an application that comes to you from Kushik or Koshik Duta. This is the developer, uh, better known for his work with Clockwork Mod. The Clockwork Mod de developer, you know, he does custom recoveries and he made um, the ROM manager application for switching ROMs and stuff. And uh, he's at it again with a, an application made specifically for Chromecast, uh, previously known again as MyCast, but now I guess there were some issues with that name and now it's called Aircast. And for whatever reason, it's called AllCast in here, but uh, he's released a demo version of this application that allows you to take any video file or picture or mp3 from your phone and beam it over to your Chromecast. Uh, and, you know, it doesn't have the same impact as battery life as if you were just, you know, trying to stream or mirror or wirelessly mirror and stream your content from your phone to your thing because it's doing all the encoding on the Chromecast itself. So. Uh, it's a pretty cool and nifty little application if you have a lot of files or homemade videos and stuff on your device. Uh, let me, if you open the application, it doesn't really do much. It just tells you a walkthrough on how to use it with your gallery, how to work and use it with uh, Dropbox, you can see here, and how it works with Google Drive as well. So it's basically just using Android's intent to share and then you share it with uh, the Aircast application. So if I jump into my gallery here, Show you guys exactly how it works. Um, the only video I have is this retarded <laughs> dumb video uh, that I made the other day in portrait mode because I was trying to upload to Instagram and it's that's the only reason I promise that's the only reason why I shot in this ridiculous orientation. But if I were to share this video, oh right here, all cast, it will then allow you to connect to, you know, ask you which Chromecast you want to connect to, select the living room. And just like that, there's my ugly mug on the TV in sideways mode because I kind of recorded it that way. It would have been nice for it to flip the video, but I don't know. Maybe Kush can work on that. Kush. Yeah, whatever. So <laughs> there you go. Uh, you can see here you have all the controls for the uh, apps. Um, for the video control, so you can replay the video, you can pause and play, uh, and then you can also fast forward if you like as well. Pausing pauses it, and then for some reason there's not a play button there, it's just something that I noticed. Um, I kind of just have to tap it again for it to start playing. And then stop will stop altogether, and you can also control the volume, which is a nice little touch as well. So, pretty much standard, um, standard stuff there. Don't ask me why I have those Barbie pictures. Uh, so you can do pictures as well, and no, you can't do pictures, so it looks like it's just media stuff, so music, videos, and stuff from Dropbox and whatnot. There's podcast support as well, but that's a quick look at Aircast coming soon to the Google Play Store. I'm Chris Chobbs with Thank you guys for watching. See you next time.